Hello everyone, my name is Wayne Irving and welcome to Wayne's Homestead. Today I'm going to be making for you a very easy egg sandwich. I'm going to be doing it outside today because it is such a beautiful fall afternoon. So stick around with me and we'll get started. Okay, so what you will need, or at least what you will need in order to make it like I make it, is two eggs, two slices of bread, bacon grease, a splash of milk, another container to mix everything in, salt and pepper, your spatula, your fork, and of course a seasoned cast iron skillet. Okay, so what you want to do to get started is take both of your eggs, crack them into your cup, Put your little splash of salt, a little splash of pepper, and of course add your splash of milk. Now you don't want too much milk, so eh, that's probably good enough. Now, my secret ingredient, if you can call it secret, I always, always, always add a dollop of bacon grease in for flavor. I never said this was healthy, but it is delicious. Now you don't have to do that, of course. Uh, some people think it's stupid, but whatever. That's the way I like to do it. Okay, so all you got to do now is beat. that and I've got yellow jackets all over the place they're as hungry as I am okay so now all we have to do since we've got that done is move on over and get it cooked now you probably can't see this but I've got this burner set on low low heat so you want to start by putting your cast iron skillet on the low heat dropping you just a little bit of bacon grease on there. That bacon grease will help keep it from sticking. Now a seasoned iron skillet should not stick. However, when you're dealing with eggs, it's always good to put you some sort of uh, cooking spray, bacon grease, vegetable oil, something there on the bottom. Eggs will get into every little teeny tiny crevice and they will stick and then it is a nightmare. Take your eggs, dump them right into the pan. And we wait. Don't do anything to it. Just let it cook, curdle up, and we'll be back here in a few minutes to, uh, to check on it. As you can see right here, the eggs are starting to curdle around the edges. I always take my spatula and I sweep it just to keep anything from sticking. But also, after I do that, I like to take it and I have to kind of slosh it around just a little bit. And that helps fill it out and make it a little bit more even. If everything's done right, this will be nice and fluffy and fit on the bread just nice. Okay, we'll let that cook just a little bit longer and we'll get ready to flip it. It is almost ready to flip. It's hardening up pretty good, cooking pretty good. Not quite, but it's almost there. We'll give it just a few more minutes. Okay, I think that's ready to flip now. Now, I'm not a cook, so I'm not a chef or anything like that, but when I flip it, I just like to swoop, grab, flip, that easy. Now there's a lot of people that will say when an egg is brown, it's already burnt, it's already bad. I disagree, but this is the way I like it. You don't have to make it go that long. You can flip it anytime you want. That's the beauty of it. This isn't a how to make an egg sandwich. This is how I make an egg sandwich. So, you know, it's everybody's, their own personal way, however they want to do it. 
Now the beauty of this is the bottom side will not have to cook near as long. So we'll leave that go for a few minutes, then we'll plate up and give it the old taste test. Once your egg sandwich is done, you just want to throw it right down on your bread. Now, the possibilities are endless. I usually eat it just like this. You can add vegetables, cheese, uh, bacon. Now, when I have bacon, I mix bacon in with it. Um, mayonnaise on the bread, however you want to do it, it's uh, completely up to you. So, But that's how I like it. We're going to let that cool off for just a minute, and uh, then we'll give it the taste test. Now, that is what I call an egg sandwich. Nice and the only thing left to do now is to eat it. Oh yeah. That's some stuff right there, I'll tell you. Mm. Excuse me. Sorry. Anyway. That is how I make an egg sandwich. Uh, the possibilities are endless. Take this recipe, it's basic. Nothing to it. Um, there's no right or wrong way to do it. Do it the way that you like it, and anybody else that doesn't like it, tell them to make it their own way, right? Anyway, my name is Wayne Irving. Thank you for watching Wayne's Homestead. Don't forget to subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and I'll talk to you next time.